you can deploy your Juji website chatbot in four different ways. To do this, you'll need to go to the deploy option and customize chat window settings. You'll notice the four settings that are available and each can be selected. Let's look at setting one. This is the one you most commonly see. This is where there's a simple widget, when clicked, opens a conversation. Let's deploy this. So we select, we copy the code, we go to the website where we want to deploy. Once the code has been deployed, we'll notice that the icon is available and that will hover in the bottom right hand corner on the website on the pages you selected for it to be displayed on. If the customer wants to, they can hide it away in case it's covering content that they need to see. And to start a conversation, you just click. Welcomes them and the customer is left to their own devices. The second way we deploy is recommended for those websites where we have a similar audience every single time. And we want to gather some visitor information before the chat starts. So we'll select option two, we'll copy the code, apply it to the website or web page, and you'll notice the experience is very different this time. The website visitor will be asked for a name to start the conversation. Option three for deployment is recommended for landing pages. In this case, we select, we copy the code, we apply the code, and you'll notice that the conversation is triggered immediately. Perfect for a landing page. The fourth and final way to deploy to your website is very similar to the last deployment, except it will ask the visitor for some details. So again, select the option, copy the updated code, apply it to the website, and you'll notice pops up immediately and ask for a name. That's all four options.